Employees supporting the Idaho Cleanup Project mission have once again delivered. For the first time in decades, the subsurface disposal area is free of heavy equipment and structures. The accelerated retrieval project began waste exhumation in 2005. In all, 10 steel-framed fabric buildings were erected over specific sections of the Cold War landfill. Within nine exhumation footprints, highly specialized heavy equipment was used to excavate deep into the pits and exhume specific waste types while keeping workers in the cabs safe. Wastes were then visually identified transferred to drum packaging stations where they were repackaged into new lined drums and subsequently shipped to WIP for final disposal. Upon completion of the mission, ARP operators and RADCON technicians safely transitioned to decontamination and demolition activities. They performed extensive facility decontamination with multiple soil lifts, applied a fixative to interior structures, brought in more clean soil, and removed fabric from each building. Operators strategically weakened the skeletal steel and then used large bulldozers to pull each building over one by one. Employees performed this challenging work safely and ahead of schedule. Now, the focus shifts to the final action for the subsurface disposal area. An earthen cover will be constructed over the entire landfill to protect the underlying Snake River Plain aquifer. The final chapter for this Cold War landfill is in sight. <laughs>